Go. All right, troop. So the wee man got this mental game thing called Gravity Tracks. It's like a mad marble run you we get in Pound Stretcher, but ten times the price. To be fair though, it's about a hundred times more fun. Oh man. The name is Pure Dead Smart, by the way. Gravity Tracks, cause it's tracks that heavy use gravity to make your wee boys fire about. The wee man was purely getting big heated about his pure dino bill, so I fired this one out. That pure top arc. You see right at the end, I've pure got this mad double action goes cannon. That is the much nuts, by the way. Then the wee man hits it with this belter here, pure knee track jumper, like the wee mind trolleys in Temple of Doom. So it's payback for his pure smugness. I said, Oh, wee man, do me a video about gravity and boys. <laughs> So Ted, the question is, what hits the ground first, a heavy ball or a light ball? Catch. Okay. These two go, the orange one is lighter, the light green one is heavier. So they're both the same size, so you can drop it from the same, the same height. Same height. <laughs> Forty-five grams. Nine. This is going to be a fair test because it's the same height, same size and the same shape. Whenever you're ready. So, Ted, same time. Okay. Did you expect that? No. Why not? I thought the heavy ball was going to do it because there's more the weight, so the more the power to go down. Ah, and what makes it fall anyway? Uh, the weight, the weight of the ball. Yeah, and what pulls it to the earth? Gravity. Gravity? <laughs> no. Does gravity do the same to both balls? Yes. Yeah, now we should scale this up a little bit, shouldn't we? Yeah. So, I'm going to chuck, chuck various uh, balls at you. We're going to not launch it from here, we're going to launch it from where? Up. Up there? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Here's another one. Catch. We need a bigger ball. Here, two rocks. Two pieces of paper. Now I want you to scrunch them up into a ball. Make it as tight a ball as you can and each bit of paper. Go! Hi. Yeah, that's not bad. Same as before, same height, same shape, shape same size. this one's the same the same size and same mass now, so drop them from the same height. Now, I want you to keep one wrapped up, but make one flat. Make it back into a bit of paper. Put one in, try and put the, the ball and the bit of paper in your hand, like that, the same height. In three, two, one. No, now, which one hit the ground first? This one. What was different between the two? This one was heavier than this one, and it's shaped. No, they're not heavier. Why are they not heavier? Because they're different shapes. Why are they not heavier? Are they the same bits of paper? Yes. Which means they're the same what? Nah. And then they have different shape because you've done what to them? We scrunched one up and flattened one. Right, so what has the biggest area? The flat. Right, and when you drop them, gravity pulls them where? Down. What's stopping the flat bit of paper? Because it's got what? A bigger what? Shape. Bigger area, bigger shape. 